With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. The question here is that the given figure shows the TS of Helianthus leaf with various part label as A, B, C, D, E, F and G. So identify the parts and select the correct option here, right? So let's see the answer now. So we could see that this is the TA section that means the transverse section of the helianthus leaf here right and after viewing it under the microscope it looked somewhat like this. Now this is the outermost layer so the outermost covering is known as the epidermis right. So the outermost layer is known as the epidermis of the leaf here. So A here represents the epidermis. Now under the epidermis is always the presence of the tissue and this tissue is known as the palisade tissue, right? So under the epidermis is this palisade tissue here. Now this is the outermost layer. This is the cortex inner part here and we could see there are two types of tissue present. The first one is columnar and the second one is oval shaped here, right? So the columnar leaves tissues, they are known as the palisade tissue, right? Palisade parenchyma here, right? And if we talk about the second type of this, then this is a spongy parenchyma. So this is spongy parenchyma. So this is the cortex part of the leaf here, right? Now this D part. We could see the D part here. D parts are the opening on the lower layer, right? So if the upper part is the epidermis, then this lower part, it becomes the, it is also endodermis layer, right? So we could say it as an endodermis and there are some kind of holes in this endodermis and this represents the stomata. Stomata they are involved in the gaseous exchange and water exchange right. Now this E part. So E part is the phloem. So phloem is one of the xylem tissue which helps in the transportation of food here right and the F part. F part we could see here right. So this circular things they are the xylem. So xylem is also the vascular tissue which is involved in the transportation of water and phloem is for the food here, right? So if we see the options here, then we have A as epidermis, B is the palisade, C is spongy, D is stomata and E is phloem, F is xylem. So option 4 is correct. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.